Um, Lance was great. Um, I, I think that those guys uh, extended some at-bats, uh, made them made work a little bit, um, got his pitch count up. You know, I thought uh, the last two, we pushed them, and so uh, just felt that right there, uh, he gave us what he needed to, and uh, he'll have an extra day his next turn. But I, th I thought he was good. He made pitches uh, like he does um, when he needs to, and in that uh, third or fourth inning, there was a big spot. He was second and third with one out and, and getting out of there with only one run. I thought he picked us up big. Is that just kind of a better thing to understand the situation, not practice or canning? It's just kind of a bit of a Yeah, absolutely. And, and I think that, uh, I don't know who it was, it was probably uh, the Jones at bat. Um, it was 3 2 and uh, made a good pitch with the slider situationally to, to get the strike out there. Then uh, Tolio was. Got him to fly out, so uh, he managed that inning. But uh, he, he was good, and I'm sure there's a little bit more in there. But again, I just felt that was good enough for Jones. Strikeouts pushed his pitch count up too, right? Yeah, you know they they just uh, he had the strikeouts. Um, there was uh, first earnings. I think he got the leadoff hitter uh, out. Then uh, the next couple innings, leadoff hitter got on base, and he just kind of created a little bit more stress. But yeah, he got a lot of punch outs. So. Hey, I think so. Um, it's just, you know, right now we're in that mode of we just know how to win and we're finding ways to win baseball games. Um, whether it's a great pitching performance or a big hit late or, you know, pouring it on offensively. So it's nice that, you know, every night uh, ultimately we feel like we're going to you know, score more runs than the other team. You know, that do it if you guys are trying to separate yourselves? Seven and a half games now in the division. That's a season high. Do you feel like you guys are trying to win? Uh, separate yourselves from those people? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Um, we're taking care of business and. You know, there's a lot of uh, playoff teams still in it, and they're kind of duking it out for, for jockeying for position. And um, we're, we're, because we're winning baseball games, there's certainly some, some more separation. Yeah, uh, yeah uh, he, I don't know if he caught a spike or something. It was his uh, back leg, right knee, inside. And so uh, on the second or third to last pitch, he just felt it right there. And um, I saw a grimace, we went out there, and then he shook to a change up and just kind of moved it forward. So right there, I just didn't want to take any more risk. Is that six inning rally kind of indicative of where these teams are right now? You know, you know, speaking for our guys, um, it, it just it was a tight ball game. It could have went either way. Um, Fergie came in there and threw a clean six, which was nice to see. And then you know, Mookie starts it off with a double, and then we sort of just took off from there. Freddie gets him over, and then. Um, just the hit by pitch and some walks and some, some big hits when we needed to. And ideally, we would have stayed away from Brazier tonight. But uh, yeah, offensively, it's, it's, it's kind of we just hang in there, and you know, if you give us a, give us an opportunity, we're going to take advantage of. It. I know you've had like just versatility is key for a lot of your guys, but having Steve Gay third, obviously with the, he has some familiarity there, but just kind of with the injuries and stuff like that right now. How valuable is just this time? It, it's great. It, it's great. You know, obviously, we gave Max a day, and to have guys playing good baseball, it gives guys a runway opportunity. Um, trying to make sure we get Rosario involved, and so uh, his versatility has certainly helped, and CT as well. So, you know, you've got certain guys that you run up there essentially every day. Um, and also, JD being down has given some other guys some of that. So, uh, it just speaks to the depth we have, and it's good because every night, you know, it could be a new guy, but they're continuing to get opportunities. But uh, I think if you ask each guy, they'd rather be there every day. Is Yancey's thing look minor, or maybe something? A little you know, um, we'll see. Um, it wouldn't surprise me if it's an IL, um, but hopefully, we got it a, a little bit before we got to that. Yeah, Dave, on Kike's overthrow, once he ate a ball like that, I think on Wednesday, do you, is that something you say to him, like maybe eat that in that situation? Uh, no, no, I, I thought with a good throw he'd get him. Um, I think Muncie's play, um, I definitely think it was the right decision to eat it. I think Kike right there, if he makes a, if he makes a, a better throw, he gets him, but he's playing some good third base for a guy that hasn't played much third base.